President Bola Tinubu on Tuesday met with the members of the Tripartite Committee on the new national minimum wage at the Presidential Villa in Abuja. The committee members were in the Presidential Villa to discuss with Tinubu on the next line of action, following the promise to pay workers over 60,000 Naira as minimum wage. Those president include Minister of Finance and Coordinating Minister of the Economy, Wale Edu, the Minister of Budget and National Planning, Atiku Bagudu, and the Chief Executive Officer of the Nigerian National Petroleum Company Limited, CEO, NNPCL, Mele Kiari. The Chief of Staff to the President, Femi Bajabia Mila, also attended the meeting. Minister of Information briefed newsmen after the meeting. We thank Labour that they have suspended uh, through to their awards uh, last night. They have suspended their strike uh, the early this morning. And uh, government on the side, uh, you can see that uh, the president has just summoned uh, a meeting of all those who negotiated on behalf of the federal government, led by the secretary of the government of the federation. We're all there to look at those issues, and then uh, the president has directed uh, the minister of finance to do the numbers and get back to him uh, between today and tomorrow, so that we can have some figures ready for negotiation with labor. Uh, let me say that Mr. President uh, is determined to... Uh, to go with what the committee has said. Uh, he is uh, also looking at the welfare of Nigerians. Like I've said earlier, government is not against, it's not an opponent of uh, uh, labor discussions, it's not an opponent of uh, a wage increase. Uh, but what is there is that government is always desirous of ensuring that there is a balance between what government pr pronouncement is and what the realities are on ground. And therefore, uh, we'll work assiduously to ensure that whatever we do, uh, whatever promises the government uh, makes will be kept. Uh, that's the idea of this meeting. A wage award is not just that of the federal government. Like I mentioned earlier, the subnationals are involved, uh, the organized private sector is involved. It's labor that staged uh, a step out during those proceedings. Now that we have come back to the negotiating table, all of us will work together again uh, assiduously within the next one week to ensure that we have a new uh, uh, you know, wage for Nigeria that is acceptable, that is sustainable, that is also realistic for all Nigerians. We've just uh, started, set an agenda, and then we'll come back tomorrow, and then we'll start the work. Is there a figure in mind, You know, the truth of the matter is that uh, we will improve. And whether they, there's a figure in mind, um, you will know that at the end of the day. They worked out, and then we called them, uh, pleaded that they come back to the negotiating table. We were expecting that everything would come to an end and then we move forward. Because there are a lot of things to do. We've wasted too much time on this. We have a lot of things to do and the mandate of the Ministry of Labor and Pro, um, Employment is to make sure that poverty is reduced and that we create jobs or, or create wealth. So why would we sit down and just uh, be wasting our times when we know that uh, uh, time's waste for everybody? So, I'm optimistic that uh, we're going to come to conclusion of this thing so that we'll be able to move to the next level. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.